you, Naughty. Look how beautiful you are. You have an eye boogie, but you're beautiful. Abby. Hi, baby. Boop. Edelin. <laughs> Hi. Boop. Good girl. Little Leela. Hey, baby. Hey, baby girl. Can I have Boop? Good boy. Hi, Felix. Boop. Boop. You're so handsome and so sleepy. Hello and happy Saturday and welcome to a new vlog. Camera's about to scoot all over this car. Oh my goodness. Um, today I just worked all day. Zane was off, um, but I worked all day. It was a long day and now we're going to pick up our groceries but before we do that we're gonna get some ice cream because we just started I was gonna say we just started eating at this place we've had it one time this will be our second time it's well, called they, they uh, opened recently yeah they did open recently um, Jeremiah's Italian ice they're in multiple locations actually it's not just a Florida thing um, but it's really good they have a combination of like soft serve and gelato and Italian ice and they do this thing where you get this like layered like Italian ice soft serve, Italian ice soft serve. It's so yummy. It's really good. I don't know what flavor I want. Do you want to just split one again? Yeah. Like split a bigger one? I are you feeling like sweet or are you feeling fruity? Last time we got, what did we get last time? Did we get cake batter last time? Yeah, I think we really got good. something with chocolate soft serve. We didn't get, oh, maybe we did get chocolate soft serve. Maybe yeah. we got cake batter with chocolate. I think so. I think today might be good. Fruit with vanilla sauce. What do you think? I'm down. I'm open to seeing what their flavors are because I guess they change their flavors yeah, a lot too. Yeah, that's true. Might be different. Um, and then we're gonna pick up our groceries at Whole Foods and Target. We just started doing grocery pickup like yeah. two weeks ago, and I love it. It takes like so much less time, obviously, to just put in my list, and then you can schedule it for later, or it'll be ready within like an hour or two, and it's just so nice. And then you don't fill your cart up with things that you don't need by walking around the grocery <laughs> store. Um, so yeah, I know I'm late to the train on that one, but it's exciting. So maybe I will do a grocery haul when we return because I haven't done one in a little while. I'm ready for some ice cream though. <laughs> yes. I don't know if I want fruity or not. I can't decide. I'll know when I see the flavors. We'll see the flavors and decide. Yum. We got strawberry with vanilla and I'm mm -hmm. very excited. I'm so excited. Take your spoon. Why are you being nervous? It's giving you your turn. Mmm. Ooh, that's good. That is a good really combo. Good. That's quite tasty. We're waiting at Whole Foods now for our groceries. And Target's still not ready yet. Mm. So a little bit slower than Whole Foods, but that's okay. We're just vibing. I think Whole Foods guy's here. All right, I'm here with a grocery haul. Kanade is here to help because she's a little angel baby. Okay, uh, Whole Foods first. I'm um, just gonna run through it. I got some apples, bonza mac and cheese, bonza pasta, because we're making TikTok pasta this week. <laughs> that trend has really stuck well with us. It's so good. Um, got these barbecue chips, because they're yummy. Ma'am, are you allowed on the counter? Shoo shoo. A sweet potato to turn into French fries, and also a regular potato to turn into French fries. Got two medium potatoes for a soup I'm gonna make. Chocolate chips because I ran out and I like to use these in pancakes and waffles. I got some almond butter because we've been making a lot of smoothies lately and I wanted to try almond butter in the smoothies. Um, black beans, uh, this one's for like a bowl we're gonna have later this week and these are gonna be for the black bean taquitos that we make. They're really yummy, I talked about those in a vlog. Three cans of white beans for the soup I'm gonna make. That's also what the coconut milk and the veggie broth back here is for. Uh, flax seeds for smoothies, rice for the bowls we're gonna make, tomato medley for TikTok pasta, got some nuggets, mostly for Zane. These are also mostly for Zane for him to take to work for lunch. Some black bean burgers, the chicken that we're gonna have in our bowls later this week, some goat cheese for the TikTok pasta, kale for the soup, carrots for the soup, celery for the soup, uh, cucumber for something. I think I got that for salad because I ran out. Mushrooms just in general, Zane eats these a lot. Uh, we didn't order this one specifically. We ordered a different one and we have it selected to not do replacements. Like if they don't have the thing that I want, I'd rather just not get it and then get it later. 
Um, but they gave us this instead. So Zane's gonna fight with Amazon to get Whole Foods to refund that. And same with this, we ordered two Oatly oat milks and they gave us the barista edition instead. This is literally the same price for half the amount. So I'm hoping we can get that refunded so we can buy like the size that we want. It's literally normal, it's just tiny. So I don't know. Two of the Dave's killer breads. I like this one the best and Zane likes this one the best. And then buns for burgers and I also just got a couple coconut milk, so delicious yogurts. And then everything else is from Target. Um, we have friends coming over tomorrow so we just got a couple frozen pizzas. Zane got this for work and then I just grabbed some sausages and some veggie corn dogs. Some sour cream because we're running low. Pickles because I love to snack on pickles. Street taco shells for taquitos. Some um, cream cheese for taquitos. And then just some fruit for tomorrow as well. So we can have some fruit with our pizza. And that is the haul. Now I'm going to put everything away. <laughs> Babies, you know what time it is. You want it? Let's see what you got this time. Edel and Leela Felix Canade Absol. The Pacific Northwest. <laughs> That's so cute. What did you guys get today? You got treats. Lazy Kitty. Salmon recipe. Oh, you got some sweet herb sprinkles. What is that? I think it's catnip. I think it's just catnip, yeah. What is this? A Douglas fir blend catnip toy. I'll open it up. Oh my gosh, do you see? Cold toe beans. Oh, it's gonna be like a coffee bean. Oh, that's cute. I think. Kanade's playing with a toy that's still attached. I guess it's a little. So the coffee, wait, there's two. Coffee beans. Eat them in. You guys like them? Are you unsure? He looks like it. Okay, they got a whale. It's a little feather coming Your out of its head. favorite. Oh my gosh, Kanade. <laughs> I love this little, it's like blowing water. Yeah, it's water. like it's blowing water. Kanade. Oh, oh, she just bit it. Oh, Absol's got the bean. So just feel it. Don't get it stuck under the fridge, guy. That's the last one that you're standing on that you drooled all over. Okay. I need to cut that. Some kind of West Coast mountain toy. Oh, Cute. Oh, oh, Edelin's batting at the bean. Nade, what do you think? Oh, she just wants the catnip. <laughs> I was playing with Edel and she smashed it out. Oh my gosh. She just wants the box. They always love the boxes. Oh. Kanani's getting a little too frisky. Uh -oh. <laughs> Leela, do you want to play with one of the new toys? These are more treats. Toy? She just doesn't really care about toys and treats. Yeah, she really does. She just likes to vibe. Do you have the catnip crazies? Do you have the catnip crazies? I know you brought the whale in. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I thought she would maybe want to say hi, but it does not look like she does. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> so dramatic. Hello, it's a new day. I just got home from work and I also just started my period. So I am feeling achy and icky, but it's okay. I might have like mask lines on my cheeks because I did work today. Oh, now the cats are scratching right below the camera. <laughs> Get that scratcher. Get it, Abby. But yeah, I filmed this morning. I filmed with the new Kai Love products and I love this look. I've been so happy with this look all day. But now I'm home, I'm in my comfy pants. I think Zane's gonna pick up comfort food for us to eat for dinner tonight because of my poor uterus. <laughs> I'm so glad I have tomorrow off. But I picked up some new makeup at the UPS store. I had a couple packages get sent to me, so I figured I would chat about them with you. First is from Aether Beauty. It's this Desert Sky Illuminating Oil. Um, it's in the shade, I don't know. I think it's just called Desert Sky Highlighting Oil. It might be too dark for me. It might not be. I really don't feel like swatching this right now because I just don't want oily shimmer all over me, but I will give this a shot at some point. It's not the kind of product I wear all the time, 
but maybe I'll give it a shot. We shall see. And then Spoiled Lips sent me a package. They don't send me things all the time, but once in a while I get a package from them. And this is actually a pretty cool package. And they sent me two pairs of lashes. I do not know what the styles are because they're not listed on the box. But look how pretty these are. And they're very fluffy. Let me actually take them out of the box so you can see a little bit better. They're just so insanely fluffy. I'm really excited to try them out. Also sent me a pink pair. Look how stinking cute. And they are gonna go so good with one of the palettes from them that they sent that I will show you in a second. Um, they sent me two of these Double Trouble, I think liquid liner duos. One side is just like a regular cream color and then one side is glitter. They have a really nice fine wand, like a super fine tip on both of them. Um, and I'm really excited about these. I think these will be fun to play with. So yeah, I have the shades green and purple. Okay, this is the palette that I want to pair with the pink lashes. It's the Call Me palette. It's got a little ghost face, but pastel. Now like the packaging's a little, little annoying. It's not gonna be super easy to store, but whatever. Here's what the inside looks like. It's pastels, it's very cute, all shimmers, no glitters. And I just think the pink lashes would look so cute with this palette. So I'm gonna play with this at some point. I don't know when, but I'm gonna play with it soon. Do some spooky spring aesthetic. <laughs> then I also got the Volume 25 palette. I don't know exactly what this is called. Let me creep on their Instagram. They have like a bi-monthly or monthly palette club kind of thing. Uh, and they'll always just say like volume, whatever number on the package. Edelyn's here. She popped in while I was searching. You wanna say hi? Not really. Are you guys not feeling it today? Me either. <laughs> oh, it's called the Butterfly Effect Palette. Okay. So it looks like this and the inside's actually quite lovely. Very smoky, sultry. We got reds, blacks, burgundies, some just like toasty colors. There are a couple of glitters in here which isn't my favorite, but I'm not totally against it. Um, I will definitely play with this at some point too. Again, I don't know when, but I will. And I'm very excited to try them out. So I just figured I'd pop in with a quick makeup haul and just say hello. Now I'm just gonna curl up until Zane gets home and then eat some yummy food. I don't know what we're gonna eat, but I am ready for it. Hello, it's a new day, new vlog. Wait, it's not a new vlog, it's just a new day. My brain is scrambled this week because of hormones, I swear. Uh, it's a good day so far. I just got done filming a little Get Ready With Me with some of those products that I got sent. And I realized that Aether Beauty one isn't like a body highlight. That's what I thought it was. It's just like you put it on your face, like you can mix it with foundation or just wear it. I just wore it and then put on like my concealer and stuff. Um, but I love how my makeup turned out today. So that Get Ready With Me should be up by the time this vlog goes up or it's coming very soon. So just stay tuned. Some of the products I got sent were from Frag. I got them yesterday. I didn't vlog it because I was just like not in the mood yesterday. I was crampy and achy and it was a whole thing. But I did play with those and I'm obsessed. I can't wait for you to see them in action. Edelyn, would you like to say hi? Oh, look at those big yellow eyes. You're so cute. She's so small. I hope you stay small forever. Uh, but today's good. I'm just gonna get some editing done and then I'm gonna meet Zane for lunch and then I'll come back and probably edit some more or play a little bit of Let's Build a Zoo. I played it literally all day yesterday because my uterus was hurting so bad. I was so crampy. Um, but yeah, that's the plan. We might go to the movies tonight and see that new kooky Sandra Bullock, Daniel Radcliffe, Channing Tatum movie. Uh, we're undecided if we want to go tonight or not, but we do want to see that soon. We have the Regal Movie Pass, so we just try to see like at least two to three movies a month to get uh, like our money's worth. Um, so that's the plan today. I will check in later. I'll take you to lunch and stuff, and it'll be a fun day. We got some lunch, some sandwiches. I'm so excited. Hey, I'm doing a face mask. <laughs> Looking scary. I will get into what I'm using here in a moment. Um, I just got off work. How's it going? I got sent a couple packages, so I figured I would unbox them with you and chat about them. Uh, spoiler alert, one of them is what I'm wearing right now. <laughs> Cause I really actually wanted to do a face mask tonight. I'm really bad at remembering to do them. I used to be such a face mask queen. I feel like I used to do one like every other day. And now it's like a miracle if I do one once a month. Um, so this is my one for the month of March, I guess. Uh, let me get into it. The first package is from Unearthly Cosmetics. She sent me over her sleepover bundle. Um, this is a pair of lashes in the shade Divine Shade, my goodness, style. 
very cute. They're like wispy, but small at the same time. Tiny bit smaller than I typically go for, but I do like how wispy they are. So I will give those a shot. Uh, what do we have here? This is, this is something. This is something for sure. I don't know what you are. I guess I will open it and find out. Ooh, it's a gloss. The Cupid Lip Gloss. Should I do some swatches? Let me get my towel. <gasps> this is so pretty. It's like gold and pink. Wow, that is cute. It smells like cake. I just had a feeling it was gonna smell good. All right, what else do we have? We have three little compacts. I think these are all little blushes, if I'm not mistaken. We have the Charmed Blush. <gasps> I love that color. If you know, you know, I've been really into like a cooler tone pink blush lately. Ooh, it's so cute and pigmented. I love, I'll probably do a video with this collection as soon as I can. I don't know if it'll be like a standalone video since it's already like been launched or if I'll just include these in and get ready with me, but I will play with these at some point in the near future. Ooh, is this a highlighter? It is, it's called Bow and Arrow. Ooh like that right there on the center it's really pretty it might be a tad too dark for my ghostly skin but I think I can probably make it work wow I look horrifying right now <laughs> didn't know you were clicking on a horror movie today did you oh here's another blush this is the cherub blush it's so cute another kind of cool tone pink not as cool toned as the first one but it's still leaning on the, the cool toned side a little bit. Oh, I love all of these. I feel like these actually all add something new to my collection, so that's exciting. And last but not least from Unearthly Cosmetics is the actual sleepover palette. Here's the cover, let me take out the plastic. And here is the inside. It's very pretty, wow. I just wanna swatch a couple of these shimmers really badly. Oh goodness gracious, these are so pretty. Let me just do the palm of my hand because I kinda took up the top of my hand. So pretty. I don't know if the lighting right now is doing them justice, but oh, I'm excited for this little collection. I'm excited to play with this. I'm really excited about these blushes and this gloss. You take a moment for this gloss. It's so pretty. Okay, and the next package is my ColourPop Avatar collection. I'm actually gonna film with this first thing tomorrow morning and bust it out and get it edited and uploaded before I go to work tomorrow afternoon. Uh, so first off, I'm, I just dropped the whole box. Whoopsie. Uh, first off is this mask duo and I'm wearing one of them right now. I'm wearing the Big Detox. The other one is Soak It Up. Soak It Up is a hydrating hyaluronic mask and the Big Detox is a mud mask. So I'm doing this. How long do I even leave this on for? Five to 20 minutes. So I'll probably rinse this off as soon as I'm done here. Um, and I might do the Soak It Up one right after just cause I don't wanna super dry my skin out. I do feel like I needed this cause I've been getting a lot of hormonal breakouts lately. Um, but I also wanna add some hydration in. This is so cute. It's the Oppa mirror. I love Avatar. It is so good. Wow, I feel like these boxes are glued shut. What in the world is happening? Oh my gosh, stop it right now. That's so stinking cute. It says, yep, yep. I love, that is adorable. We have four eyeliner pencils. We have the, what are these called? Blown Away, it's like a metallic neutral. This one is called Groundbreaker. I know this is a brown, but I don't know if it's metallic or not off the top of my head. I will open all these, but I kind of want to leave some of the packaging intact for my video tomorrow. This one is Making Waves, it's a blue, and this one is called Fiery Fierce. I think this is like a reddish brown color. I'm very excited about those. I love eye pencils, and ColourPop has great ones in my opinion. What is this? Oh, look at him. I love him so much. Uh, the Jasmine Tea <laughs> Overnight Lip Mask. I do love the lip masks. I'll actually 
plop it on right now. Oh, it smells very good. It smells like tea. My lips have been very dry lately. So this is great. Mm-hmm. That smells delightful. It's so refreshing. We have two glossy lip stains in the shades Fanatic and Sealed with a Kiss. We'll open these guys up because I actually don't remember what the colors of these are off the top of my head. Oh, that's cute. Just kind of like a burnt reddish color. And Fanatic is more of a bright reddish color. I really like the glossy lip stains actually. I feel like they're very comfortable. Um, yeah, I'm very excited. I like the packaging on those a lot too. What is this? Oh, these are the two highlights. Hopefully I didn't shatter them when I dropped my whole box. I did not. Cute. Oh, I love them. I'm just gonna leave these in their boxes because I wanna be able to just like showcase this whole thing and then I will take them out. I don't know which one will be my color though. I feel like Moon Peach will suit me a little bit more. It's hard to tell. We shall see. And finally, we have the palette. Oh, look at all them. So cute. It's just gonna slide right on out. Looks like a book. So cute. It has the gold foil and everything. This is such pretty packaging. Imagine that just sitting on your shelf. It literally looks like a DVD. <laughs> Here's what the inside looks like. It's so cute. I do wish there was like a more true green in here. There is this dark like olivey color, which I'm happy about, but I do wish there was like a green green in here for Earth Kingdom, but for the most part, I'm pretty darn happy with this collection, honestly. I'm excited to play with it tomorrow. I have a mess to clean up now. Um, oh, I meant to update you yesterday when I vlogged a little bit. Unfortunately, my Lethal Cosmetics package is just not coming. <laughs> I did order the Nightflower palette. I mentioned in the last vlog that it was being delayed a lot. Like it was supposed to come on Monday and then Tuesday and then Wednesday and then Thursday. And then on Friday, it just said delayed. So I reached out to them and I was like, hey, just wanted to check on the status of this because it was supposed to come and now it's delayed and I just wanna know what's up. And they got back to me on Tuesday, which was not a good day. <laughs> I was like super crampy, my uterus hurt so bad, but they got back to me on Tuesday and basically just said like mistakes happened and somehow my package just didn't get processed. So it didn't get shipped out. And now they're out of pallets and it's under pre-order. So my options were to either like wait a few weeks and then they would ship one out or just get a refund. And I decided just to opt for the refund because I was already supposed to have it a week ago. <laughs> it already takes quite a while to get shipped and I didn't wanna wait an additional like few weeks and then however long it takes to actually arrive here. So unfortunately that package is just not coming. I'm pretty bummed, but it's all right. I got plenty of makeup. I don't need everything. Just was not meant to be, but I did just wanna update because I'm sure some of you are waiting for my video on it and I am sorry to report that it's not coming. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I have a mess to clean up now and then this face mask to take off. Uh, I will catch you next time I vlog. I don't even know if I'm really going to vlog the next couple days because tomorrow I just am going to be filming and working all day long. And Saturday I'm also working a lot. I think we're hanging out with a friend Sunday, but I don't know if I'll vlog. I kind of just want to hang out, you know, not like worry about the camera. I'll just be back when I feel like coming back. Hello vlog, it's a new day. It's just been a really lazy Sunday for the most part. We've not wanted to do a whole lot. Um, but I did film, I filmed a little Instagram video and now we're gonna go to the movies. Cats are all fed. I need a blanket for the movies. I always bring a blanket with me. We're gonna see, I don't even know what it's called. I just keep calling it the weird Sandra Bullock movie. It's called Lost City or something. Lost City. I don't remember. <laughs> it looks silly from the trailer, so we're going to go check it out. We're going to go get some candy, and it'll be a fun time. I will recap when we return. We are done with the movie. Yeah. It was pretty good. It was very silly. Yeah. Lots of jokes, cheesy action, like making fun of action movies kind of vibe. Yeah. It was pretty silly. I don't know how much like rewatch value I would say it has. <laughs> That's kind of how I like to judge movies because I'm such a perpetual rewatcher. Um, I don't know if I see myself rewatching it. Wow, yeah. this, this lighting. <laughs> wow, I can I be any more of a ghost? I can't even turn yet because <laughs> cars are there. But yeah, it was, goodness gracious, the sun hurts. <laughs> 
Yeah, not a movie I'd <laughs> see again, but, you know, watching as part of our movie subscription, th- th- not a problem. We have quite a few movies that are coming out in April that I'm excited for. Uh, Morbius. Dumbledore. Um, yeah, the new Fantastic Beasts. We need to watch the first two again because it's been too long. I don't remember um, anything. Shoot, uh, what, there was another one. Oh, Sonic 2. <laughs> I mean, I don't have my hopes up very high for Sonic. The first one was just, like, kind of cute. And usually those kind of cute movies, like animated video game style movies, like, the sequel's not usually great, but give it a shot, we'll you know? We'll see. <laughs> I it's, like Sonic We have the past, so... You know. Oh, there's that funny. one movie. The bad guys. I mean, that one I'd, I'd see. That's <laughs> probably just another everywhere, one. Everything everywhere all at once. Yes, everything everywhere all at once looks amazing. Yeah. I'm super excited for that. Do you want to see that? But for some reason, we were trying to find tickets for it, and they were like all not available. Like we couldn't find the movie anymore. But it is coming. I saw a poster for it in the theater, so we know it's going to be there. Yeah, I googled it, and apparently, like, just a lot of theaters didn't have advanced tickets, because I guess they need to do their soft release first or something like that. I don't know. I don't know how it works. I don't know how the movie industry goes. But regardless, I think I'm going to end the vlog here, because tomorrow all I do is work, and then this vlog is going up on Tuesday. So, thank you so much for watching. If you made it to the end, um, what emoji should they leave, Zane? Um, a, a movie emoji. <laughs> I don't... Okay, then leave whatever emoji you think, like, relates to the movies. There you go. <laughs> and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It helps my channel out a lot. And if you're not already, you can follow me on my other socials. Oh, gosh, the camera's scooting. <laughs> I'm holding this so precariously. You can join the Batty Bean fam. I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. And if you want, you can subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. I'm posting most days over here. And now we're at a stoplight and it's really awkward. I don't want people looking at me. Uh, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Okay, bye. bye.